Hello and welcome back friend. My name is Elio G, the crappiest gamer to walk this earth. And today I'll be reviewing a Memoir Blue, which is very different from the typical game that I play, which you probably can't guess from what I have on my channel so far. So let's get into it. Developed by Cloisters Interactive, the Memoir Blue is described as an interactive poem about a superstar swim athlete and the relationship between mother and daughter explored through a weird dream she has. It kind of reminded me of myself, except I ran cross country and track in high school and I didn't win anything. Also, I was born in a family with all boys and I'm the youngest so as you can imagine my mother was disappointed I wasn't a girl. Anyway something I liked about the game was the artwork. The backstory of the relationship between the main character and her mother was animated while going through the gameplay itself was more well defined. Graphics I normally don't really care about as I feel the story and gameplay of the game are what mattered to me most. The story was really deep as in you really dive deep into the water. It left me wondering how she was able to breathe but then I remembered it's all a dream stupid. The deeper she went down the more we discovered about our hero. But really it was sad most of the time which was great because it matches my mood. The ending was probably the best part for me though as it was pretty uplifting. As far as gameplay goes it was super simple. Mainly you would just navigate through I guess puzzles but honestly it just felt like I was watching a short the whole time. Only occasionally stopping to do stuff to remind me that I'm playing a video game. Examples of the type of things the game has you do are harassing the main character with taking pictures, turning on a radio, and sapping some train tickets. Okay, maybe it's not that exhilarating, but at one point you get to break a lot of stuff. It reminds me of Christmas at my house, but without all the yelling. The game itself is super short. It took me probably 50 minutes to beat, which is a nice change of pace compared to other games that take me over 50 hours to play. I also enjoy the music. Like I tell all my non-existent friends, something I look forward to in video games is the music, and a memoir blue has an amazing soundtrack. I enjoy the game for the most part. If I had to say anything I disliked about it, it would have to be the gameplay. Were some of the things I had to do really necessary, like sapping those tickets? What kind of customer service is that? Worst train ride ever. In conclusion, I thought the game was fine. I didn't hate it like I hate myself. So good job, Cloisters Interactive. The story was really heartfelt and I'm not gonna lie. I did tear up a little at the end. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go give a hug to my mom while I still can. <laughs> Anyways, that's it for today's video. Super short, I know, but this was a super short game. Please be sure to like this video and if you're new, please subscribe to my YouTube channel so I can finally move out of my parents' house. My name is Elio G and I will see you in the next video.